Cityscape used to be held in, in a tiny little conference room in one of the hotels. Now we are a, a 42,000 square meter exhibition, uh, over nearly 300 exhibitors and, and we have visitors coming in from the four corners of the world. We now have seven editions of Cityscape. So to run an exhibition is, is vital that you have the ability for the infrastructure to, to support the exhibition, to allow people flying in, people traveling from all over the Emirates, people traveling all over from the Middle East, and all the other international visitors that we have. Giving them the ability to find hotels easily, transport, public transport, etc. Whenever we work closely with the Dubai World Trade Center team, the answer is always, how can we support? And this is a great phenomenon, and that's why we hold this partnership with great stead and we continue to help with, uh, with Dubai World Trade Center support, continue to grow that and reinvigorate the market. Last year was the first year that we were allowing developers the ability to sell directly during the exhibition itself. So, yeah, now we saw great generation of a new type of visitor attending the show. This year we, we will be holding the first ever business hub which allows the, the business aspect of it, the consultants, the architects, engineers, developers and institutional investors to gather with the government heads and really understand what's going on and how to drive the market forward. So we have some amazing stands this year, such as from Azizi, who have some 1,500 square meters worth of stands. And then you have companies such as Dubai Holdings, one of the master planners for Dubai, uh, who are here really to represent their brand and to talk to the, the market about a, a multitude of different master developments that they have. Cityscape helps to reinvigorate that, that energy which is needed to drive the real estate. It's a phenomenal opportunity for people to really communicate what is happening in the real estate market.